For today's video, we're going to try out the new Founders drum roll. And this is what it looks like up close. As you can tell, it sort of has like a laser as well as a flashlight. Hi, can I help you? Yes, I'd like one of those flashlights. <laughs> oh. Now I know what you're thinking. Won't that just shed more light on the penises? But you know what? <laughs> That's a risk. <laughs> I believe the only other weapons that have flashlights are the Tiger and Rat King. But yeah, that's what it looks like. You'll be able to get it from either the Ultimate Edition or you can get it from the Limited Edition if you choose the Soldier class. But as you can tell, it's currently not available. Anyways, the perks we're going to use are Magazine Size Damage, Physical Damage, Crit Rate, and Crit Damage. And for every 10th round fired, it increases your weapon damage by 15% and that can stack up to 4 times. And whenever you reload, it's going to remove that effect. So at most you can have two magazine size and two fire rate perks. You can also have up to four damage perks. At most you can have two crit damage perks and only one crit rating. And you'll also be able to choose between any element. But these are the perks that we're gonna use while we test it. And at the very bottom it says assault weapon light machine gun, a heavy weapon with high damage, an extreme rate of fire, and a large magazine size. Inaccurate unless aiming down sights and firing in short bursts. And while we test it, we're going to use Bulletstorm Jonesy as our commander. Because not only does he increase your damage, but he can also increase your fire rate. Which is going to help us shoot 10 rounds and increase our damage faster. We're also going to use the Totally Rocking Out Team perk. And for our support team, we have Breakbeat Wildcat, Main Stage Quinn, Rescue Trooper Ramirez, Crackshot, and Sledgehammer. And the mission we're going to do is this Power Level 132 Fight the Category 3 Storm. And we're also going to do it solo. But before we get into the gameplay, the first thing I want to do is show an example of the new 6th perk. Every 10 shots you shoot, it's going to increase your damage by 15% and that can stack up to 4 times. So after you shot 40 rounds, you'll get the maximum damage from your 6 perk and you'll keep that increased damage until you reload. And you can tell when it increases because you'll hear a little noise as well as see a little effect. With one magazine size perk, we have a total of 87 rounds in a magazine and it uses medium bullets. Wait. Also, uh, okay, whenever you get an increase in damage, your magazine will start glowing. Let's go ahead and get another increase. It looked like it's pulsating a little bit faster. Let's go ahead and increase it again. A little bit faster, a little bit more intense. And here's what the magazine looks like when you've maxed out your sixth perk damage. Anyways, here's what the fire rate looks like while using Bullet Storm Jonesy and without any fire rate perks. And there's what the reload speed looks like. It's about 3 seconds, which is about average when it comes to LMGs. Protect yourself. Return to sender. I also want to see if it causes propane tanks to explode if you hit it. So first let's shoot the propane tank. Oh. Let's shoot the propane tank first. Yep, it will explode if you hit the propane tank. I also want to see if it penetrates through the shield or shield. And it doesn't look like it does. I also want to test it out against power level 132 Miss Monsters. And first we're going to start off with the Smasher. We were able to deal up to 100,000 damage with it. It took us about 40 bullets to kill him. And let's go ahead and try it out against this blaster next. Took us about 18 shots to kill him. And I also want to try it out against the tank. And we did about 70,000 damage that time. So yeah, that's what it looks like against power level 132 Miss Monsters. Alright, here we go. See what element we get. Hopefully it's not nature. Oh, we got water. Okay, that's alright. I didn't see a notification earlier, but we'll be alright with water. Uh, we did go ahead and build some trap tunnels for this one because uh, obviously this isn't as powerful as the Nocturno and we're playing solo. But we mainly just using wall launchers and floor freeze traps to push them back and push them into our pits. And we also have three defenders. They're each using the founder's drum roll as well. So everybody's using it. And I'm going to try my best not to reload here because that's not a good idea. Make sure we take advantage of that extra damage we get. Oh, they're breaking through over here. 
And I don't know how one of our defenders is down. Which one? Which one of y'all is down? I think it may be this one over here. Yeah, I got you. Get the word. But yeah, when it comes to the Founders drum roll, like I mentioned earlier, the way you get it is from either the Limited or Ultimate Edition. Uh, if you get the Limited Edition, you're going to have to choose the Soldier class. And when you get the Ultimate Edition, you get all the weapons. But obviously, that's not available in the store yet at the moment. But if it does come back to the store, I'll be sure to let you all know. And I don't know why I'm standing still. This is not a Spec Ops weapon. I'm having flashbacks from the last weapon set. But yeah, it seems like it works pretty good with defenders. They're actually taking a lot of them out right now, which is pretty good. Obviously not the best weapon when it comes to There's defenders. That would be the Nocturno and Obliterator. But still really solid. Looks like they're changing directions and we don't have any traps towards the northwest. So we're going to have to be careful here. I could build a little bit more, but as you can see, we're like right at the limit. I'm not going to overbuild unless we absolutely have to. Plus, this gives us a chance to get more kills with our drum roll. But yeah, there's a lot of different heroes you could use with this. We could have used Light Show Spitfire to increase our magazine size. I feel like this weapon also has the potential to uh, use a lot of different roles, like fire rate magazine size wouldn't be too bad either. But we're using Bullet Storm Jonesy to increase our fire rate. Feels really good with them by the way. And I'm going to go ahead and check on this other side. Oh, how did he get to the top? Yeah, we got some people breaking in over here. I will put that in my slow field, but we got uh, we got a mini boss on this one. I'm gonna go ahead and save it for the mini boss. Score repair, all this good stuff. I can't get you yet, Defender. Not without overbuilding. You're on your own. But yeah, there was a lot of different loadouts I was thinking about using with this one. So uh, there are some other ways you can increase your damage. You could, we could have chosen both two crit damage perks instead of just one. Let's go ahead and get this defender. Hopefully she's the only one that's down. I'm down. What? It didn't get her. Oh, she's over there. I can't get to you. Uh-oh. You might be on your own, girl. And they're breaking through over here. Oh, they are really yeah. breaking through. What are y'all doing over here? Oh, reload, hurry, reload. Reload's really slow. But yeah, when it comes to LMGs, I would consider this to be a top two LMG and save the world at the moment. Look at that. Just destroyed everybody. Uh, I think the only one that may be able to compete is maybe the Swan. I know the Candy Corn's also really decent. But yeah, I would consider this to be like a top two, top three LMG and save the world. Definitely better than it used to be. Well, we need to reload here. Down! Let's go ahead and check on the other side. I guess I'm just going to have to go ahead and go over the limit because I need to get this defender. And Did they break through? Nope, not yet. Oh, they did. Which one was that? It's the one right in front of you, A1. Yeah, we're going to have to get our defender here. All right, let's go ahead and go over the limit. Help. And I did this the wrong way. Hopefully I don't go down here. You're going to have to help out, girl. <gasps> oh, man, they are really dealing damage. Okay, which one is that? C? Which one is C? Oh, it's over here. Yeah, I haven't been over here in like a minute. Let's go ahead and repair everything over here. I forgot about this one. But yeah, I would consider it to be a top two, top three. For those of you who have tried it, let us know what you all think about it. Obviously, the only things we're going to get this week are Rabbit Raider Jonesy and 
I need to repair all this stuff. And Cottontail Eagle Eye. Uh, I don't think I'm going to review hands, those because. Oh, mini boss is here. And I still need to repair this. Let's try to get our defender back if we can. Oh, they're both up. Okay. They're just not doing their job. I probably should have put them on the ground level since they're using LMGs. May have helped a little bit. Let's try let's try it out on a mini boss though. Oh look at that. Damage is good. We did over we took away over half of his health with just one magazine. Let's go ahead and finish them off. And we gotta repair our oh man, we gotta repair our thing. It's about to go down. Uh oh. I need to go straight there. I'm going. I'm on my last clip. I'm sorry, you're on your own, Grandpa. Please. <gasps> That's the last thing that you can take. It can't take no more, people. It cannot take no more. Dad. I can't go to the other ones either. This is bad. Uh, but yeah, the main reason they're sort of breaking in over here is because I did not want to go over the build limit. I should have went over, though. I should have went over. I know, Ray. I'm working on it. Uh, we got one on top, too. Yeah, I'm not really worried about that C right now, Ray, because these are about to go down. Oh, man. we Let's go ahead and use our war cry on this one. No. Let's use our war cry. Here we go. I don't know if we're going to make this, people. This is too close. Eight seconds. It's too close, people. If we make this, we're we're amazing. Oh my goodness! It's too close. Did we get it? <gasps> we did it. <laughs> oh my goodness! What a nail biter! I had to lean forward towards the end there. <laughs> it, was, it was a little too close. All right, so we got a level four loot chest with some gold, pure drops of rain, and hero XP. We also got some more gold. As well as some epic perk up and some re-perk and legendary perk up. Let us know which one you all would like to see next. The quick shot or the deconstructor. Because I think we may try to review all the ones that got new six perks. But yeah, that'll do it for this one. I hope y'all enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.